In the Republic of Austria, the municipality German, Gemeinde, sometimes also Ortsgemeinde, is the administrative division encompassing a single village, town, or city. The municipality has corporate status and local self-government on the basis of parliamentary-style representative democracy a municipal council elected through a form of party list system enacts municipal laws, a municipal executive board and a mayor Bürgermeisterin appointed by the council are in charge of municipal administration. Austria is currently January 1, 2018, partitioned into 2,098 municipalities, ranging in population from about 50 the village of Grimay in Tyrol to almost 2 million the city of Vienna. There is no unincorporated territory in Austria. Basics <laughs> 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 The existence of municipalities and their role as carriers of the right to self-administration are guaranteed by the Austrian Constitution BVG Art. 116 The Constitution means for municipalities to be autonomous in any matter that a village, town, or city can presume to be both interested in handling and best capable of handling. Municipal authorities are required to comply with national and provincial legislation and can be held accountable by courts for failure to abide by the rule of law, but they are not politically answerable to national or provincial administrators and do not take orders from them. BVG 118. All real estate in Austria falls within a municipality's borders, meaning that there are no unincorporated areas and no way for either the government or any resident to sidestep the requirement that each permanent resident be part of a municipal community. BVG 116 2. All municipalities are corporations and have the right to own property, run businesses, levy municipal taxes, and generally manage their own financial affairs. BVG 116 3. Municipalities have a right to form municipal associations, subject to supervision by the provincial administration BVG 116A and enter into treaties with other municipalities BVG 116B. Municipalities are miniature parliamentary democracies with a legislature elected by the people and an executive branch installed and supervised by the legislature. The Municipal Council serves as the communal legislature. Its members are chosen in free, secret, universal elections. Any registered permanent resident of the municipality in question who is eligible to vote in or stand for provincial elections in the province the municipality is in is also eligible to vote in or stand for the local municipal elections. By default, this restricts suffrage to Austrian citizens, but provinces may choose to extend the right to vote and run in municipal elections to citizens of other European Union member states. The Constitution stipulates party list proportional representation as the default voting system but allows direct votes for individual candidates in case there are no organized political parties choosing to run BVG 117 2. The Council is a deliberative assembly reaching decisions collectively. BVG 117 3. Its sessions are public BVG 117 4. The Municipal Executive Board supervises the community's administrative apparatus BVG 117 7. The number of seats each political party holds on the board is proportional to the number of seats it holds in the council BVG 117 5. The mayor Burgermeister, Femme. Burgermeisterin is the community's head of government. By default, the mayor is elected by the council. Provinces may stipulate that the mayor be elected by the constituency instead. BVG 117 6. Provincial legislation may provide for municipal referendum and other forms of direct democracy, within limits. BVG 117 8. Municipal governments do not have judicial branches. <laughs> Types of municipalities Larger municipalities are typically granted city status The distinction, while important in medieval and early modern times, is purely symbolic today. City status does not currently confer any additional legal responsibilities. There exists a number of cities that are barely more than villages at present and that are labeled cities merely because they used to be regional population centers in the distant past. The city of Rattenburg, for example, has a population of about 400. 
The city of Hardegg has about 1,200 inhabitants, although the historic city core minus Hardegg proper without what used to be the surrounding hamlets minus is home to just 80 souls. Constitutionally, the main difference between municipalities that are cities stad, sing, shtat, and municipalities that are not is that in cities, the municipal executive board is called not a Gemeindevorsten but a stadtrat BVG 117 1. A similar distinction, meaningful in the past but symbolic today, is that of market town Cities that are economic and administrative centers of wider geographic reach can be elevated to statutory city status. A statutory city is vested, in addition to its purview as a municipality, with the duties of a district administrative authority. The status does not come with any additional political autonomy. District administrative authorities are essentially just service centers that citizens use to interact with the national government, for example, to apply for driver licenses or passports. The national government generally uses the provinces to run these points of contact on its behalf. In the case of statutory cities, the municipality gets to step up. Just like Austria has a number of villages that are nominally cities because they used to be significant in the past, Austria has a number of minor towns that hold statutory city status because they used to be regional capitals a few centuries ago. Examples include Wadehofen and Der YBBs, population ca. 11,000, or Rust, population ca. 1900. A municipality that desires statutory city status today needs to have at least 20,000 inhabitants. BVG 116 3. The municipal executive board of a statutory city is called a city senate. Stat senate BVG 117 1. Informally, municipalities that are neither cities nor market towns are sometimes called Landgemeinden, lit. rural municipalities. Responsibilities The Constitution distinguishes between a municipality's sphere of inherent responsibilities and the sphere of responsibilities delegated to the municipalities by the higher levels of government the Constitution defines a minimum extent of the inherent sphere that national and provincial law may add to but not detract from, BVG 118 Levying municipal taxes and otherwise managing their own finances and their own property. Appointing municipal officials. Hiring and supervising municipal employees. Local security police and event control Traffic space management including but not limited to road maintenance and traffic police. Crop protection Sanitary police matters, rescue services, interment services. Public decency Development planning, fire prevention, and general building code enforcement. Mediation services for out-of-court dispute resolution. Additional legislation vests municipalities with a large number of additional responsibilities. Municipalities are in charge of public water supply, sewage disposal, garbage disposal, public lighting, and cemetery construction and maintenance, among other things. They run schools and kindergartens, assisted living facilities, sports and cultural facilities, and fire departments. The purview each Austrian municipality is constitutionally guaranteed to have is a small share of the purview it has in practice. Matters of public services far outclass matters of political administration in terms of both salience and budgets, Rashauer 2009, RZ 330. Regional particularities Subdivisions The cities of Vienna, Graz, and Klagenfurt are divided into municipal districts Stadtbezirk, colloquially just Bezirk. Municipal districts are not to be confused with administrative districts Polidisch Bezirk, but colloquially also just called Bezirk. Administrative districts are provided for by the constitution and play an important and highly visible role in Austria's national and regional administrations. Municipal districts are subsections of local administrations established by local laws. 
Vienna, Graz, and Klagenfurt are statutory cities and as such are equivalent to one administrative district each. The 23 districts of Vienna and the 17 districts of Graz are vested with a limited form of precinct-level self-government. The district constituency elects a district assembly the district assembly in turn elect a district commissioner District assemblies and commissioners are responsible for whatever matters the city chooses to devolve to them, in general, they run schools and take care of road maintenance, general neighborhood maintenance, and traffic planning. They have a certain measure of budgetary autonomy, although they cannot levy taxes and depend on money allocated to them by the city. The 15 districts of Klagenfurt are roughly neighborhood-sized quarters with no special autonomy. Statistics As of January 1, 2018 there are 15 statutory cities in Austria, 186 other cities, 770 market towns, and 1127 other communes, for a total of 2,098 municipalites. One of these municipalities stands out, the city of Vienna is a statutory city and a state at the same time. At 1,900,000 inhabitants, the national capital also seven times larger than the second most populous city, Graz. For the other eight states, the numbers are as follows Statistic Austria 2018. With respect to population, there is wide variation within each class of municipalities. With respect to area, the smallest municipality is Rattenburg at 0.11 square kilometers, 0.042 square miles. The largest is Solden in the thinly populated mountain territory of Tyrol at 466.78 square kilometers, 180.22 square miles. The city of Vienna ranks second at 414.65 square kilometers, 160.10 square miles. <laughs> 